U.S. Capitol. It is Wednesday, January 17th. Uh, I'm here for a, um, a house hearing on space, on the commercial crew programs that NASA has authorized to return America's astronauts to space uh, through our own new space capsule. As you know, the space shuttle retired many years ago and we're on the verge of returning to space with our own U.S. platform. Pretty exciting. But before I go over to the Rayburn House office building, which is just over there on my, to my right, I want to wish uh, Aunt Bernie a very happy birthday. Today she is 87 years old. Bernie, I would love to have you down here to see the Capitol, even on a freezing day like this. And it is about 25 degrees right now. There's a wind chill, and my hand is freezing. i got a nice glove here on the other one, but wow. Take a look around. It's kind of quiet, as you imagine. It is just before 8 o'clock in the morning. People are coming to work. But really, you know, we had a, a dusting of snow last night and this morning, about an inch. And you got a lot of salt on the road, so it's the, the drive in wasn't that bad. The building I'm going is right over there. It's the Rayburn office building just behind those trees. So I'll be here for the morning. Most of the morning, probably leave around noon. Uh, here to support the executive for Boeing CST-100 Starliner program. And if you haven't uh, had a chance to read up on that, you might want to go CST-100 Starliner, uh, made by Boeing. We're going to have the first uncrewed launch in August, and we'll have the first crewed launch just sometime around the end of the year. So anyway, a very exciting opportunity to come here and inform the House about how we're doing on the program. And we do have an article coming out in the Washington Post probably uh, before the end of the week, so you might want to look for that too. Well, aloha from Washington, D.C., and again, happy birthday, Bernie. See you soon.